What's up? The Comic Coalition here for another video for you guys today. And unfortunately, no, we are not going to Toys R Us. But we are going to a little place called CC's Pizza Buffet. Going to fuel the hunt. Today I'm going to be looking for the new X-Men wave of Marvel Legends and stuff. So stay tuned and be sure to grab some snacks. Because this is going to be a good one. Okay, time for the first stop of my journey. Walgreens. A lot of people have been finding them X-Men waves here. So the blind man. Oh god, just a bunch of these Walgreens pack warmers. Yeah, it's looking ugly. Clearance Power Rangers over here at Walgreens. All right, I am now on my way to Target. Um, a lot of things I'm looking for, a lot of things. For one, I'm looking for that Target exclusive Gamorrean Guard Black Series figure. Had no luck with that. I haven't had little luck with Black Series figures in a while. Um, I'm trying to think. I mean, the Marvel Legends, so many Marvel Legends I'm looking for. Um, if you haven't checked out my other video I posted the other day, I did wind up getting the Doc Ock Marvel Legends from the um, robot Spider-Man wave or whatever he's called. And that's the only figure I really want from that wave. I might get more figures from the wave eventually, but that's only if I get bored and I don't have anything else I need to grab. But at the rate they're putting all these Marvel Legends, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be swamped. And I have SDCC, oh, what about like 10 days from now? And I know I'm going to spend a lot of money for that, buying a lot of Funko Pops. But yeah, they're just dropping Marvel Legends after Marvel Legend after Marvel Legend. I just, you know, like not too long ago, like a month ago, built the Thanos Builder figure and the Sasquatch Builder figure, completed those waves. And then, bam, Infinity War Wave 2 hits. And I got one, like one figure out of that wave. And before I could even grab more, like, all these other waves are hitting now. I know, um, for one thing, the thing figure is starting to pop up at Walgreens. We got the X-Men waves popping up. We got the Deadpool, the new Deadpool wave popping up. All that stuff, man, it's getting overwhelming. Um, not to mention, I mean, the pops aren't slowing down. And see, when I first started, well, not first started collecting, but for a while, it was kind of comfortable because I mean, Pops weren't coming out as fast, and these Marvel Legends weren't coming out as fast. Yeah, there was less to hunt, but it wasn't overwhelming. Like, this is overwhelming. When there's literally three or four Marvel Legends waves that weren't supposed to drop, you know, yet, that are just all dropping at once. Because, um, you know, even some people I know have them on pre-order, they're just now getting, like, um, they just now got Infinity War Wave 2 and stuff a couple weeks ago, and before they knew it, the SPDR wave is right there, and then the Apocalypse wave, and these waves are coming before these waves, even though these waves are supposed to come first, and it's just Marvel Legends crazy. But I'm about to go to Target. My Target, last time I went, was a lot better than it's been in a while, thanks to all you guys that reached out to Target for me. Um, Luckily, I was able to get the Target exclusive pops that I wanted, so I'm not really going there for pops right now. Although, who knows what might happen, but I'm really just going there to see if they got these Marvel Legends. So I'm going to check in with you guys once I get to Target. Traffic is kind of backed up right now. And, hey, I just wanted to say, I have my seatbelt on. Can't say I didn't have my seatbelt on in this video, at least not for right now. 
so one point for me one point for me 99 points to you probably Man. Toys R Us been gone. Bro, this shit was $20 when I walked in there. How much is it here? I caught some stuff at Toys R Us like 90% off for it. Yeah. Bro. See, now it's 69. That's because we had Target. And now at Toys R Us, it was $20, y'all. How much is it here? That's because Toys R Us is going out of business. And that sucks. <laughs> because I told, it was $24.98. And now I'm mad because I love stuff like this. If I would've got, I could've got four sets. And we all be playing. <laughs> You know, drunk tag team in the hood. <laughs> the laser tag, that's what they call it. Hell yeah. No, man. I should have brought it when I seen it. I'm so mad now. There's a lot of stuff I, I've left that I missed out on. It's $69 here. This was $24. I'm blown by it. Probably could have got for like $8 on the last day. And, and look all the features. I don't know if you ever seen this, but y'all don't know. I played this with somebody. Look all the features. You can put it on your phone. It's got like ammo. It's 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 like that Pokemon. What happened to back in the day when you just had Nerf guns? Nerf guns, yeah. It's like Pokemon Go though. You know, once you look at the app, you can go to ammo, walk over to bullets. Look at the airstrike. Look at this. They actually got an you airstrike. Drop an airstrike on they got an airstrike, bro. How this the game, fuck do you drop an airstrike? On the phone. It's like Pokemon <laughs> Go. I mean, I mean, you know, once the phone link up. Oh, I get it. I get yeah, it, yeah, it tell it. you where to go. It. I just seen it, the the smartphone attached to the side of the gun. Okay. I oh, see. the side of the gun. I see. Man, <laughs> now we can't afford that. <laughs> Twenty four dollars, man. I missed out on that. Well, oh well, that's life. Uh oh, Marvel. Dun dun dun. dun. That guy, that guy, and the truth. And like. They're restocking these X-Men legends all over the place. By the way, how y'all doing? I'm representing for the Comic Coalition, also AKA Geno Vision. This is my homie, brother, love him to death. And we gonna <laughs> do this thing, you feel me? I love comic just as much as he does. <laughs> he probably turned me on some stuff I didn't know about. Now look at all this, we got the, oh man, that's a mean You seen this two pack before? Oh, oh snap they got the mega man and iron man y'all was tripping this is gonna be limited edition soon i wish they would have had it bigger yeah six inch yeah because that look like them gi joe toys back in the day don't it? yeah it's like three seven five inches but this will be this will be worth money just as it is don't even open it like if all you gamers and toy buyers out there if you just keep this how it is because marvel versus capcom is kind of like a cult culture and yeah. I'm telling you, best fighting game of all time. Definitely. Best fighting game. I don't know. Z Fighter gives us a give it a yeah. gives it a round. Yeah, but that's money. the new age though. Yeah, that is new age. Hey, but you know where they got most of them combos from? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Dreamcast. Man. Yeah. Dreamcast. Exactly. That is a, man. That's a nice one right there. I like that. I like that. Oh. It was good. It was just. <laughs> Yeah. Man, after you see Infinity War and Black Panther, and you go see Ant Man and the Wasp, man, it's it kinda, doesn't go with the, it's yeah. underwhelming. Cause uh, you know the stakes ain't high, ain't really much going on. Does it go with the storyline though? It ain't got nothing. This it takes place before Infinity War, but the end uh, credit scene. Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! You should put that every time. It's a spoiler alert. I'll be like this. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So end credit scenes, bro. Motherfucking Ant Man gets stuck in the quantum realm. Yeah. And everybody else is on the outside, like Hank Pym, um, the Wasp and everything, they all turn to dust. They all turn to dust. So this man- Wow, so it well, does kind of go with it. At the end, the movie ain't got nothing to do with, with Infinity War, but at the end it ties in like, so now Ant-Man stuck in the quantum realm. That sound good though. Yeah, but the movie is good, it's funny, but it ain't, it ain't that it ain't action. It's Marvel material, are you serious? It's Marvel material. But you, something missing, I gotta go see it. I will go see it tomorrow. <laughs> Y'all should too. If you're in Savannah, Georgia, it's five dollars <laughs> on Tuesday. That's on everywhere. Tuesday and Sunday. I think that's everywhere. Tuesday and I Sunday. I saw yesterday on Sunday, five dollars. Five dollars, man. Y'all better um, get with it. Check this out, though. They got this new multiverse if over here. If I had enough money, I would definitely buy this for my son, just that's, so he could look at it. That was on clearance a couple of days ago. Well, not a couple of days ago, but a couple man, weeks we ago. I missed out. That thing said twenty four dollars. <laughs> I knew I should have brought it. Cause I know it's sixty nine everywhere, and I've played the game. I've actually played that laser tag game from previous. Oh man, it's fun. Cool. That one huh. definitely dope. I like this little pink thing right here. <laughs> you like the toilet looking one? Yeah. It's a toilet. Oh wait, it's a toilet. It's a toilet, <laughs> it's a toilet dude. It was up at first. I like the hamburger and fries. Yeah, I like that one. I like this one. You know, I like something with class like this. Yeah. 
No, they're like, not super hot wheels, but they do got some dope ones. Yeah, you know, that's my era, you know. I'm an 80s baby, so. Like, I like the Flintstones. Yeah, like the Flintstones and stuff. Old that school, one, is, like that one is actually that's dope. dope. I like that. This one is too. It's a Batmobile boat. Still attached 19, to the trailer. From when the hell Batman ever had a trailer for his boat? That, sh that thing stayed in the 1966 board. Batman, probably. Yeah, look at it. Classic TV series Bat Boat with trailer. <laughs> like, really? Batman don't need a trailer? There's stuff in the water waiting with a with yeah. a GPS signal. If there is a trailer, it's a bat trailer. Ain't it? Before there was GPS. <laughs> the old Street Fighter 30th anniversary stuff we grew up off of. They got Street Fighter 1, 2... Two Alpha, two Turbo. Wait a minute, they got all the good ones. Street Fighter Alpha, Alpha Two, Alpha Three. Boy, I might have to get this. <laughs> I don't know if my son likes Street Fighter, but this could be a mean <laughs> birthday present. Got to introduce it to him. Yeah, no, he know about it. Oh, best believe. Any son of mine know about this day. <laughs> but it's the 30th anniversary. It's got Alpha. Everybody knows. If y'all didn't know. Alpha was what introduced Street Fighter like to super super mainstream. It's already mainstream, but Alpha made it super turned up. What really turned out the game was this one though. I remember like Street wasn't Fighter when Alpha Turbo. came up came out that they came out with a new um Super Nintendo controller. Yeah, and guy and all them. This is boy, that's a that's a steal for 39 if you really like that that's type of game. Bad. For real. What else we you got? know, I prefer to play it on the old systems. Exactly. But that's the old game. I know it's the old game. You, know, you know, I got some uh, of the original ones. Yeah, yeah, on yeah. Because the controller Super Nintendo now, ones. So. We just four buttons, not 18 of them. Mm -hmm. Which one do I push? <laughs> well, actually, Super Nintendo did have the four. Super Nintendo. Shout out Nintendo. Was the one that actually introduced to left, right. Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. Actually, Nintendo introduced everything, man. Really, if you're in the market for a video game, we should hit up, man. GameStop. GameStop? Because they... Yeah, because that is cost way too much. Here, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Shaq Fudo? <laughs> yeah, Shaq Fudo came back out. <laughs> See, this is something people don't know about. They don't know about Shaq. Shaq it, wasn't it wasn't good. It wasn't good. But, but it was fun. good for us. Yeah, it was fun to play. It's like a new Shaq Fudo. Yeah, I'm not kind of interested on a low. Me too. I might... Mm -hmm. <laughs> my, my ace on, listen. I still got Shaq food. Yeah, you sure do. He sure does, y'all. You got a lot of inches stuff. You got stuff, and I'm 34. That's like an eight year difference. You got stuff that I don't even have. And that's amazing, though. That let you know. Real comic book collector right here. Real toy collector. Dynasty Warriors. Ooh. Yeah, that's my shit. Yeah. I love Dynasty Warriors. I ain't played it in a while, though. Me neither. One, I don't, Dynasty man, it's Warriors. Already going nine? to him. I think I stopped in like five. You remember we used to have it back at the house? Oh, yeah. Yeah, at the hoose, my bad. People would kill <laughs> me if PS, I don't see On PS2. PS2. They got stolen from that same hoose. <laughs> we ain't gonna talk about that. We used to have a lot of wild parts and leave the door open. <laughs> 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 Alright, he got a PS4 too, so let me see. I might be able to get him Sonic Forces. I heard this was a good game too. A lot of people, I haven't played this, but I heard the reviews and I have no people that play this game. They say this is like, it's like Sonic turned up now. I don't know. Y'all can tell us at home what y'all think about this, but I'm yeah. definitely thinking about getting this. I ain't played Sonic in a long time. Me neither, but I've heard I've heard good reviews about that one, man. We should hit up that GameStop. Well, there is no pops over here of no. interest. No. None. None of interest. Mad Max, really? Come on. Well, let's see. Let's see. Yes, let's they see. got all those well, Target got... exclusives. Oh, never mind. I thought that was Deadpool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they don't have nothing over here. Yes, now he's playing for us. <laughs> we about to walk into this game, Stizzop. Oh, Sonic Black Knight. I never heard of that one. Have you? No. What? I looks like you tried to do too much of that. Yeah, one. too much. That's, oh, man. I ain't trying to play no Sonic Knight. Nah, Sonic does not need to have a sword when he has metal hair. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. I'm walking in to see what they got. You see how much you Yeah, Yeah, now Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, this always been my dude though. <laughs> For some reason. <laughs> Not to 
to mention Mario. Look at Mario. Oh, um, what? Hot Wheels? Yeah. <laughs> that's dope right there. Look at this dude. Oh, look at look at this. Who is that? Oh, it's Shawn Michaels. The, the original Shawn Michaels with the colors. And he's right next to the best quarterback of all time. Yeah. Brett Favre. Ah, you better know it. Of all time. Y'all have got to get this, though. <laughs> this is a collector's item. The reason why that I say dope, that. That looks dope, man. I really like that. The reason why I say that, Shawn Michaels, back when we all remember him, didn't, didn't even wear these colors, you know? He's like Ultimate Warrior right here. Yeah. I remember like DX, Shawn Michaels. DX, yes. yeah, you know, all rugged. One of my favorite fun clothes. With a scooter. With a scooter, Deadpool. It's a nice one right there. We got here, Untamed. Don't know nothing about that. that. <laughs> Don't know nothing about that. Like, yeah, this looks awkward, like a fingerling <laughs> mark. In the Lego section. Now, hey, do any of you guys know if the Harry Potter Legos, are those only going to be at Target? Now, I did find them at Target and stuff. But I was wondering, are they also coming to Walmart? Because I've only seen them popping up at Target so far. And I wasn't sure if they'll be going to other retailers besides Target. Or if it's just a first to market at Target or what. So if any of you guys have the information, let me know down in the comments below. I'm really starting to work and get like my Lego city together. Like it's coming together. I need a few skyscrapers and things, but I'm really looking for a few little pieces that would go good in the city as well. A lot of Tobias Beckett exclusives. And as you guys can see, Look at Walmart Tire showing me no love in the Marvel Legends tip, no love whatsoever. Starting to be Yeah, it's starting to be one of those depressing times again when there's nothing new on the shelves. So we were watching Harry Potter last night. You know, I've, I've read all the books, but I never saw all the movies. Like the last three or four movies. I didn't see. So I'm thinking I might get some Harry Potter stuff today. Yeah, brickheads. Brickheads are growing on me, man. Too bad our dog Yamcha ate one of our brickheads. Yeah, I know, right? I like this. Do you want to go to a hundred acre bush? Uh, you know, Lego journals? Yeah, those are awesome. I feel like we should come up with the Lego heads. This one does. No poo. Okay, just a teddy bear. You should get this book. It's the official novelization. From the all new lab action. I kind of do want to read this. How many pages is this? It's a whole book. Like 300. Let's go. Let's see what type of pops they have. To really bad though. 
Dragon Ball cookie jar. Mm -hmm. Dragon Ball is it on clearance? Or Dorymon on clearance? It's Dorymon for $11? Yeah. I got it. It is. For real? Yes. Well, it's a statue. Oh. Yeah. They have Dorymon pillowcases. <laughs> I love him. Yes, it does. It doesn't have articulation. Hmm. What figures do they have on here? Jiren. I'm good on him. Chaba. Kaba. Kaba. That's funny. Give me that, um. Super Saiyan. He's cool. Yeah, but I'm good. I think I'm going to get Jiren. Who's Jiren? That alien looking dude. In front of the I think his name is Jiren. I haven't gotten this far. Hmm, it's awkward. But nevertheless, I think I'm going to grab him. Try to make him like pop so with his eyes. Yeah. They're white eyes. Mm -hmm. Um, did I show you that, um, new Little Mermaid pop and they put a mouth on her and everybody's making fun of it because it looks really I terrible? I'll show it to you in a second. Oh, like that. Is this a coffee maker? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, as you can see, they have the SPDR wave in here. I also got these new DC multiverse figures and. Mm -hmm. I'm not too sold on this. I love the packaging, but the figure. It looks kind of off. <laughs> All right, I am now back at the man cave. I did pick up a few things today. I did pick up a couple of things. Now, as I told y'all when I was in Barnes and Nobles, I'm starting to watch all the Harry Potter movies. I saw like the first three, read all the books, but then I fell off and didn't see all the movies. So there's there's a few movies I didn't see. But anyway, in honor of that, I decided to pick up the Barnes & Noble exclusive Gilderoy Lockhart Funko Pop. Thought it was a cool little pop, nothing special, but it's Barnes & Noble's exclusive. So I figured I would go ahead and pick it up. Okay, I also picked up a Transformers figure. Picked up Optimus Prime over there at Walmart. Looks pretty badass. Decided I'll pick him up now. You guys know I'm not... I'm not really big into bots. But I got Starscream. Figured I'd go ahead and pick up Optimus Prime. See what it was talking about. If you want to see a review for this guy, let me know down in the comments below. And I'll try to crank out... Um, a quick review for him sometime in the coming days. But yeah, I picked him up, picked up the pop. Like I told y'all, I'm working on my Lego City. My girlfriend thought it would be a good idea to get a little pizza truck to have in my Lego City. I think that's a good idea as well. Everybody likes pizza. Everybody likes food trucks. So now my Lego City will have its first <laughs> food truck. And last but not least, I picked up my first Dragon Stars action figure. I've been holding on to these guys for so, so long because I'm more of a fan of the SH Figure Arts figures. But I cracked down, broke down, winded up getting him. Now I know I'm going to be buying all types of Dragon Star figures. Oh Lord, what did I get myself into? I've recently been watching a lot of Dragon Ball Super. If you didn't know, I have not finished Dragon Ball Super. I'm only on like episode 45. Or like 44. So yeah, I am way, way, way behind. But nevertheless, I haven't even seen this guy in action yet on the show. I mean, I've seen it in YouTube clips. And I've heard people talk about it, but I've I haven't gotten to the part of the show where Jiren even shows up yet. So, yeah, I'm sadly, sadly, way way behind. But 
that's my entire haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs down. If you totally dislike this video, give it a thumbs down. But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. But be sure to subscribe, and as always, you have a good day, YouTube.